Through this simple video, I intend to help you understand how to construct a Pareto chart using Minitab. The Pareto option in Minitab lies in the Stats menu. Click Stats, go to Quality Tools. If you see the second option on your right is a Pareto chart. Click it. In the first column, Defect or Attribute Data. This is where you would put in the nomenclature of the attribute information that you pick, picked up. If you see here on my C1, I have the names of the ticket types that I have for a particular IT operation. So, so here I will double click on C1. Then, you, then the next thing it asks you is frequencies. I will double click on the column C2 wherein we have the count of the number of tickets. Double click. Press OK. And voila, here, here you go. You have your Pareto ready. You can pick, pick up the crosshair and check exactly where, what is the percentage contribution of which part of your defect. Pareto can also be used, let me click outside first. Pareto can also be used to help you identify the percentage contribution and the cumulative percentage contribution of, of each issue type. Let's say if I see the uh, software category contributes to 43% of the total tickets while the hardware category contributes to 18.7%, others 13.6%, email 12.7%, 12, 12 networking issues contribute to 9.7%, etc. When you look at it cumulatively, software, uh, software is 43.3%. When I add 18.7% to the 43.3%, I see that software and hardware put together constitute about 62% of my tickets. If I add 13% of the others, I see 75%. So if you were to prioritize, you would end up saying that if I were to look at only the software, hardware and the others category, I would end up attending to 75.6% of all tickets. Let's do it again. Stats, quality tools, Pareto chart. I hope this simple video helps.